Yeah, hello and welcome back to the TRM Car Breaks channel. Today, Troy and I got a package. It's gonna be a unique opening for us. I've actually already opened it because it came in a couple days ago and I couldn't wait. Me neither. We received a shipment from HGA. This is our first set of cards that we sent out. So I did package it just like how it came to us. Yeah, this came in before our cards that we sent into PSA that we sent in like a year ago. Yeah, we sent some PSA cards back in uh, September and at the beginning of the year and haven't gotten them back. Uh, we did the 30, the uh, 60 day shipment. We did the 60 day turnaround time on these and that's about how long they took, 60 business days. So I'm going to try not to reveal them. Oh, the box has some more styrofoam. I was really impressed by the grading we got though. It, yes, uh, I'm very happy with the grading. We'll reveal that here. So let's try to hide some cards at a time. We'll slide this underneath to kind of make sure nothing gets revealed. But first card is from my PC, Jeff Samarja, 2007 Bowman Chrome, blue refractor. I got a nine, which I was super happy with, uh, seeing how I've probably had this card for a long time and neither bought it on eBay or Com C. 9.5 corners, 9.5 edges, 9 for the surface, 9 for centering. And on the back, they actually do list the grade, the autograph grade. So this card number, actually here we go. The card number here is 55 out of 155. I actually have, I actually have two or three of these. And I don't have any that were graded, so that's why I sent this one in. I do have some uh, regular refractors and X-fractors that are all graded from Jeff Samarja. Mm -hmm. This one... Our best one. Will actually come up. We'll reveal the card. So I'm pretty sure I pulled this out of a pack a long, long time ago. 2013 Mike Trout. Emerald. And we got a 9.5 out of that. Which I was super excited, super pleased on that. Yeah. Nine corners, nine five surface, nine five edges, nine five centering. That's an awesome card. Originally, I thought this is a card I might sell, but when it came back in nine five, I love the label to go with it. This this is the keeper, I think. Yeah. It's the second year, actually. It's yeah, it's either a second year or third year Mike Trout. I think it's the second year. So I just missed out on that rookie one. Yeah. Otherwise. Whew. But uh, I love that card. This next one here, Anthony Volpe, Bowman Sterling Autograph. I'm pretty sure I bought this on eBay. I bought a handful of Anthony Volpe's and he's been super hot lately. And really, really happy with this grade. Another 9.5. Got 10 on edges and centering, 9.5 on corners. Struggled with the 8.5 on the surface, but it's still got a 9.5 overall. And the autograph on the back got a 10. Ooh, yeah. So, super happy with that one. That card's probably gone up quite a bit in value since I got it. I probably bought it for less than $20. This is another card that Troy and I pulled. Luis Robert Beam Team from uh, Stadium Club Chrome. This was the disappointing grade in 8.5. Yeah. We got crushed on the surface with just an 8. But I don't know any better. I did not go through these with the magnifying glass or anything, so... A lot of them are probably shot in the dark, but still a very cool looking card. Troy and I have been a big fan of the Bean Team cards. Yeah. 
And our fifth and final card. Tops Chrome 2020. This is a red refractor. Got a 9.5 on that. Super happy. This is definitely a PC card. Just kind of sent this one in on a whim. It's two out of five. This is actually the red refractor. There's two reds out of five. There's the red refractor and the wave refractor. But uh, this was a straight PC card. Just tied to send it in. But super happy with what we got. Mm -hmm. Obviously, just the margin cards are some of my favorites. A little disappointed on the beam team because that, that would have been something we would have probably tried to sell. Yeah. The Volpe. Love that grade. Love that card. He is doing good. Probably long term long term hold. If not, something that's gonna stay in the PC. Mike Trout. I we don't have his rookie card, don't have any of them, but this one's awesome. And super happy with the Jeff Samarja grade. Yeah. So we do have two more submissions into HGA. We sent them about a month, six weeks after this. Uh, when we got this one in, it was hard. HGA was having uh, limited releases, a limited uh, availability. Right now, they're limiting how many people can submit, but uh, they're not selling out every week. So it's much easier to get in. Um, like I said, we have two more out there. Uh, one's four cards and one's three cards. And we also sent in um, one that will just come in the casing and have a, a design like that, just without the grading. Yep, this past week, HGA just announced that they were going to do slabs without grading, custom labels. So we sent seven cards in there that were straight PC stuff. Uh, I was somewhat scared of grading. If I would have known that uh, we were going to get as nice a grade as we did, I might have sent some of those cards in for grading. But those cards are pretty much straight PC. So for $13, we sent them in. Uh, these cards only cost us $20 to grade a piece with the 60 business day turnaround, which took right around three months to get to us. So let us know which card was your favorite and let us know if you used HGA for anything. We'll see you next time on the TRM Card Breaks channel.